Hello, this is Candy Hurley, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about how food affects your mood. So notice how you feel when you eat certain foods. Do you feel sluggish after eating a big meal? Have you ever noticed when you are hungry, you might feel angry or hangry? Food and mood have an effect on one another. Even if you have a healthy diet, it's normal to want a high calorie, unhealthy food diet when stressed or depressed. It makes sense. Your body wants to fuel up for fight or flight mode. There's a reason it's called comfort food. If you consume fats and sugars for too long, your body will adapt to it. One study showed that eating fruits and vegetables every day was equal to the joy experienced by an unemployed person finding a job. And it's also linked to higher levels of happiness. When consuming omega-3 fatty acids such as salmon, fish, nuts, and oils, um, it should help keep depression at bay. Dark chocolate is shown as a mood booster as well, which is great news, although you don't want to consume too much of it. Here are just some examples of foods that I eat. Um, berries, and I mix it with um, plain Greek yogurt. Um, oranges for vitamin C and vitamin A in um, the sweet potato, which is all excellent for your skin as well. And really good mood boosters. You notice how you feel. You can focus better when you're at work. Um, try it out and let me know. Maybe eat after you eat those donuts at work. Notice how you feel. Maybe try eat some eggs if you can, eggs and kale. Um, maybe you can wake up a little bit earlier and, um, or even meal prep. It's worth it for your health. Um, I will be giving you more information about it very soon. Hello, this is Candy Hurley, and I invite you to do a guided meditation with me today. I'd like for you to get comfortable in your chair and relax. Take a deep breath in and place your feet flat on the floor, really feeling your feet underneath you. And just take a few more deep breaths. So I'd like you to start by focusing on your toes. Scrunch them up and then release. Now relax your ankles, your calf muscles, your knees. Remember to let any thoughts that you might have float up and away from you in an air bubble. Now relax your bottom and begin to notice any tension that you might have in your back. Breathe deeply in as you breathe out, slowly relax and release any tension you might have in your back. Now your shoulders, lift them up and then release completely. Now it's time to relax your neck and your jaw muscles. Take a deep breath in and as you breathe out, let go of any tension you're holding in your neck and jaw. After you have done that, it really can be easy to create a little more peace and calm in your life. So I invite you now to take a breath for a moment and to begin to move your attention back to the room, listening to the sounds around you and begin to open your eyes.